Hello, teachers, parents, and students. Welcome to the Phonics Station. Today, we are learning to identify and match rhyming words. Learning rhyming words enhances phonemic awareness, vocabulary development, and reading skills. It fosters creativity, improves memory, and promotes a love for language, aiding in early literacy and communication. Don't forget to download and print today's lesson. I put the link in the description box below. All you need to do is print them out for your students. For this activity, you will need pencils, crayons, scissors, and glue sticks. If you and your students enjoy our interactive lessons, please hit the like button, share with all your friends and colleagues, and please subscribe to the channel so that you can get notified about other videos we post and we will get the credit we deserve for all our hard work we do to create these interactive learning videos for your students. Enjoy the lesson. Okay, boys and girls, hello. You ready to get started? Okay, we're working with rhyming words today. Do you know why words rhyme, boys and girls? Think about it. Why does hit and kit rhyme? Hit, kit, why do they rhyme? If you said because they have the same ending sound, you are absolutely right. Let's read the directions before we get started. It says, read the word, then cut and paste the word that rhymes with the word in the box at the top of the page. And you know what I did, boys and girls? I gave you clues to help you out. Okay, let's say the words hit, kit, mit, sit. All of these words are rhyming because they have the same ending sound. Hen, repeat, hen, Ten, ten, men. All of these words are rhyming because they have the same ending sound. The only thing I changed was the beginning sound. Take a look. Hit, hen. Do those words rhyme? Hit, hen. No, they don't rhyme. I can see you nodding, shaking your head, saying no, they do not rhyme because they do not have the same ending sound. This is, these are the it words. These are the n words. Okay, let's get started. First thing you need to do is get your scissors. And I'm going to cut straight across all the way to the end. Notice my scissors are at just above the dotted line. Dashed line, however you want to say it. And I'm going to carefully cut out my pictures. And when I'm done, I'm going to have all the it words on this side and all my end words on that side. my two and it words and here are my other two it words so you should have four words that end with it and we have four boxes and we should have four words that end with en Take a look at the first word, hit, your turn, hit. Which word can we use to rhyme with hit? Hit, mitt, that's a good one. Okay, did you find the word, the picture with the mitt? Because hit and mitt 
a rhyming words. Kit, kit, hit, kit, hit, kit, hit. Those rhyme. Okay, mitt, sit, mitt. Sit, kit, sit, kit. There we go, we did it. Mit, hit, mit, kit, hit, mit, sit, sit, kit. They all rhyme. Now let's do this side, the N words. Hen, pen, ten, men. Can you sign, find a picture that rhymes with hen? Yes, here it is. Ten. Hen, ten. Hen, ten. Pen, pen, hen. Pen, hen. Ten men, ten men. And pen men, men pen. You're doing a great job, boys and girls. Here we are, we're done. How about that? We're done matching our rhyming words. Hit. Mitt, repeat after me, hit, mitt, kit, hit, mitt, sit, sit, kit, hen, ten, pen, hen, ten, men, men, and pen. They all rhyme. Okay, boys and girls, time for our favorite thing to do. Time to color the pictures. Now I'm going to fast forward the video and I'll be right back. Okay, boys and girls, we did it. Very good. I know you did a great job coloring, boys and girls. You did such a good job matching the rhymes. Don't forget to write your name at the top. Parents and teachers, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And we'll see you next time.